Yeah. I love it. Yeah. Daryl's in it. I'm baby. not going to say much, but I'm, I'm here. You just got to hear. Why don't, you yeah. start, why don't you start us off? Uh, welcome, friends and family, to <laughs> Working On It Pod. <laughs> Again, he's new. <laughs> Take it away. We I got motherfucking it. JoJo C. JoJo C. She's back. She's back. A long time friend. Known you since you turned. What was your birthday at Brookstone? Oh gosh, holder. Brookstone. You? Was it Brookstone? Brookstone. No, it was. It was Barnes and Noble. Barnes and Noble. Barnes and Noble. I would have been. I just aged myself. Well, it was your birthday. What? We haven't known each birthday. other for eight years, but actually, we met for the first time at Kids Choice Kids Awards, Choice. and I was eleven. We got nine years, almost ten. Oh my god! I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> oh, we're gonna throw up. That's we've disgusting. never looked better. We look sick. <laughs> we're aging so well. We're growing up well. We all we got our new teeth, and we look gorgeous. We got our veneers. <laughs> we got our veneers. We got our hair. We got we our, got our bodies. Our bodies. <laughs> we found it. Snart. You Facetime me the other day wearing a full bulletproof vest, and I was like, "What's going on?" And you're like, <laughs> "It's a weighted vest. This is how I live." And I Literally like, every day of my life, because like, then you take wow. it off and you're. An angel. You worked out. Yeah. Have you heard of this, Ryan? Wait, you work out in the weighted vest? Of course. No, but she how much weight? Life. How much weight? Oh, she you, lives life right. in the weighted vest? I live life in it. Yeah. So it's, I have one that's 10 pounds, then I have one that's 15 pounds. Bro. And then I have weighted clothing. So I have also, a, by the way, clothing. you wearing that is me. <laughs> Get you're not wearing that all day. What do you mean? <laughs> but it just like it just adds a little bit. So if I'm doing like everyday tasks, it just like yeah, I'm huffing and puffing. Over here, adds a little bit. That's a smart scheme. I it's like so it. Is. I don't think I'm gonna I adopt just, that. But yeah, yeah. I just had no warning. So when she FaceTimed me, I was like, are "You good?" Everyone <laughs> is like, "Why the fuck are you wearing a bulletproof vest right now?" That is everyone's quote to me. It's, and then it's when alarming. I when I walk my dogs, I this is where I get psycho. I wear a forty pound one. What? And that one like. That, that one doesn't even look like the bulletproof vest. That one looks like I have bullets in the vest, like ready to it's go. Humongous. It's massive. I look like an FBI SWAT Do you notice agent. a difference? Or are you just like, oh, oh yeah. I'm more tired? Oh, yeah. Your legs, your ass. Oh, burn. And then you just to do this. You take I mean, it off and it, you're drenched. 40 pounds. Think about. That's a lot. Yeah, it's a lot. Yeah. I'm holding it right now. That's crazy. My <laughs> question is, uh, why are so many people so concerned with what you're wearing or what's going on with the tattoos? Like, people are just like, why, why, I why? I really are thought so you had a no. sleeve of tats, dude. Honestly, <laughs> I, I I have like a little bit of residual of one left. Um, no, they were the tats, stick-ons. Yeah, they like, they literally last for like two weeks. They're, but the people are obsessed with you. I don't, I don't get it. <laughs> My son has fire twucks on his arms. <laughs> mm-hmm. I just know why people Maybe just don't like, live their own lives. Like, they're very concerned. No, they with... love because we love her. And we watched her grow up. Two and we're types like... of people in the world. The ones that entertain and the ones that observe. Okay. Wow. Oh, I like that. Period. It's a Britney lyric. I know. I like, I was like wait. That's should, the only wait, two types of people, people in the world. world. Nice. That's so yeah. good. Yeah. And so I think that's why people are so interested. I mean, I've always believed that like I'm here to entertain. You know what I mean? I'm here to I'm here to give people a good time. Um, but yeah, no, it is, it is funny that whatever I do, it's, there's a pattern, right? People hate it. Stupid. Then all of a sudden they're like, wait, it's not that bad. Then all of a sudden they're into it. It's like it, every time I do something new, every time I change my style, every time I say something, sing something, do something, walk a certain way, wear an outfit to an event. It's like, fuck you. That's disgusting. Wait, actually, why do I keep looking at it? Oh, right. maybe. You know what She's I mean? Fine. So it's, it's a pattern that I've been used to. But the fact that you know that is like... <laughs> I just learned it. It's been a long nine years of like, realizing who that. You, who taught yeah. you this? Or who's like, no. do you have someone to talk to? No, uh, you. I'm like, <laughs> but like, I, I get, I was 19 when Bass came out. And so I guess I grew up in front of everyone. But you grew up like at... Nine. Well, how old were you on those shows? So AUDC, my first show, I was nine. Yeah, that's a baby. A baby. So you like grew up. I grew up. And I think where I'm lucky is it is all I know. All I know is being in front of the public eye. And I, I did start in one of the most judgmental environments yeah. with Dance Moms. I mean, on the show is super judgmental. And then also off the show is super judgmental. I just saw a clip of you oh God. asking like, hey, what's the solo today Oh God, or order, order of the solos. Have you yes. learned nothing? And yeah, she went, Jojo, have you learned nothing? And I was like, what did she ask? And she was like, you're interrupting a, like adults yeah. talking. And I was like, what? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, look, it's, I did interrupt to adults. Like that's, it is a thing, but I, I didn't know they were talking. Abby was just on one that day. She really was. Um, but I think nah, I'm, I'm, I'm lucky because like people who start later in life and have a whole normal, normal life. One of my best friends is 30 now. He started when he was, mid 20s right he's like how how are you a functioning human like how can you handle this and i'm like it's literally all i know 
I when you called me too, I thought that's what was coming, and I was like, should we turn off comments? Because I will. Like I hate it here. It's, and my manager the other day was like, I think all blue checks should turn off comments or yeah, everyone and, come everyone, together and yeah, turn off. Yeah, the comments. come together. <gasps> oh my god, like all of us. It has yeah, to be everybody. Just go, all oh. nothing. Oh, like fuck you. Good luck now. Yeah, don't yeah, you can't yeah. have fun anymore. <laughs> yeah. I mean, look, it's 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 hard, but what I've realized is it, it, they're commenting. They're talking. I love you more than most people in this world. I would never open all three of you, any of your comment sections to comment a good thing. Much I would never I know. I know, you know what I mean? Anything. And so it's like for somebody to actually see something and then open the comments and comment something that should take effort that takes yeah, time it's a lot of bandwidth like, that, people are putting time yeah that takes video. effort it's <laughs> making my average view direction yeah, 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 yeah. I was you, gonna say the numbers are pumping you're just such a boss about it cause you're like like it or not what's been in your head this week and I was like comments a bitch like a bitch I sing it everywhere it's, <laughs> I literally like like, That's my answer for anything I'm like com- oh, comments a bitch <laughs> I was a bad girl yeah, yeah, yeah. it's it's all, he it's, just walked by me and was like, I was a bad, bad girl. girl. I said, like, it just exits my body. It's I can't like, help it. But I'm a bad girl. I just, I'm I was a bad, bad girl. Help it. You can't help it. And it's, it's working. Like yeah. whether, whether, what's crazy. So I looked today. I was like, I want to do like a little analytic deep dive. Right. You're smart. So like TikTok, for example, is where I like care the most about analytics. And I'm fascinated by it because it is newer in the scheme of things of when you're comparing to Instagram or Twitter, or it's, it's just newer. And you know how, like, most your views come from the For You page, right? Like, normally for me, it's like a 90% For You page, 5% following page, 5% Followers search. Followers never see your stuff. Like, <laughs> but it's always if something pops, it's For You page. Yeah. Right now, my, my, like, all my videos that are, like, popping off or, like, doing good or getting a lot of views are 50%. 49 percent 60 percent like all all in that range right 50 percent profile views so people are going to my profile to watch it right oh, i am mm-hmm. and then it's like 20 percent for you page and then so let's just say that takes us to 70 then it's 30 percent search so all of my views right now they're going out of their way it's not even like it's getting like pushed out to for you page it is in a sense but like compared to normal mm-hmm. it's like people are searching for it or they're going to my page I'm, to see yeah, it. Yeah, now think about it. I'm constantly going to your page. It's like, going, what the fuck is she posting? Did I miss one? Did, <laughs> yeah. I, did I miss something? Let me see. <laughs> my plan is yeah, working. Yeah, dude. When You're I started, the queen of promo. Thank you. Thank you. When I when I started this release, I didn't really, I didn't really know, like, officially my game plan. Like, we, we had the, like, we, we had a, like week one, week two, week three, week four. Oh, you did? Mm-hmm. Week five, wow. week six, week seven, week eight. We do. Uh-huh. I don't even do that. Me and Chris it's, just go, should we put something up today? And like, then we, and then hope we for the best. Us. Yeah. But and like, then we'll be like, well, that one didn't work. Let's do another one. <laughs> Let's try again <laughs> yeah. tomorrow. Yeah, no, we had a whole plan in play. But the night before day one, my photographer, who's amazing, was like, hey, can I fix the coloring on the photos that you're putting up tomorrow? And I was like, Oh my God, no, we have to fix everything. It's awful. I hate it. Mm. Stayed up all night and changed the whole plan for week oh, one. Oh, Jesus. And she was like, no one thought that. I just was like, I'm like, tweak the blues. Like nothing, nothing crazy. <laughs> you're right. It sucks. I was like, I was like, <laughs> actually, like, no, you're right. This is all uh, wrong. This I is all wrong. My music video is out today and I colored it like two days ago over again. I was like, start from scratch. I don't like it. Yep. Yep. Yeah. All of a sudden you just have like that quick little conniption. I was here. like, does anyone else see green in my hair? And they're like, you're looking too hard at this point. I was like, all right. <laughs> you're like, all right. Yeah. Let's go fix it. Yeah. <laughs> Like take out green. I don't get it. Yeah, it's it's do your. Yeah. There's a lot that we do absolutely, that no one looks at. and we are gonna watch it with the most critical eye. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, but yeah, we we had our whole plan, and I didn't realize how intense the plan was gonna be, and I had like my like videos plan that I was gonna share week one, right? But I was revealing all of my outfits on like day three, and I was like, oh people are enjoying like what they're getting right now. Like, let's slow down. Let's slow down a little bit. And so yeah, then you, I started- You're the only artist. And I tell my team that because it gets me fired up. You're like showing the behind the scenes first. And I'm like, oh, 
well, I gotta watch the video now because this is crazy. Like, and it like ramps up. And yeah, it, and it's nobody but, does that. Mm -hmm. It's that's another thing too. Like I always say, like put the BTS like behind this, like the official BTS video out. Yeah, before the video that always comes after, and I'm like, no one cares by that point, you know, like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> But you can you can cop off the view of it because people are like they want the sneak peek, you know yeah. what I mean? And so yeah, no, I've done That's that my favorite thing you do since I was a kid. And then yeah, some comments were like, "You're already giving away everything," and you were like, <laughs> "I haven't given away anything in the dark <laughs> so like, with my fucking yeah. teeth." <laughs> like you can't see me right now, but I haven't given away anything. <laughs> no, like actually given away nothing. What does that mean? Are you making out, dog? Are you making out with some girl? Like, are you making out? Making you got a little like, kiss, kiss, little kiss, like, kiss. Actually, in the pool. When I is when is this <laughs> coming out? Do you know when this is coming out? Next, trying to go next Wednesday. Next Wednesday. Okay, oh, so the video. Let me see. It should be out, right? Video comes out on the fourth. The video coming tomorrow. out tomorrow. Tomorrow, nine p.m. Um, Pacific Standard Time, because technically it's like oh, okay. midnight. April fourth. Got, yeah. got, got, got it. Got it. Got it. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, but there'll be, I mean, so many sneak peeks are out there, so, and it's literally a day later, so unless you're listening to this on the day, like, here's all the spoilers, yeah. but, like, my- Our fans listen to it as soon as it drops. <laughs> Loyal fans, okay. <laughs> Loyal fans are getting the exclusive right now. Um, no, but, like, the visual for this song, I knew was the important part, because I've always been such a visual person, yeah. like, I- I love music, but like, when have I ever come over here to record and be like, I am a singer? Literally what never. What do you mean? <laughs> Literally never. You're like, yeah, I'll try. And then you do it every time. <laughs> the best is like, we'll be writing and Megan will be like, you want to go do a demo? I'll be like, nah, you got it. I go, listen, let me sing the demo. And then we'll just do it later. <laughs> I was like, you can do it. You can do it. I ain't singing in front of you. <laughs> no. I, you I do. love singing you in front of so Megan. Good. She helps you. She holds your I hand. Coach, and, yeah. and you can get. I, you know, I just think she's blowing smoke up my ass the whole time because she's too no. happy. You're too excited. <laughs> no, when you get it, I'm like, oh, she got it. And then yeah. I'm like, you're beautiful. You're perfect. You're amazing. I love you. <laughs> because I know what that feels like. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, I can't imagine. Yeah. No, it's, it's tough. It's tough. Um, yeah. But yeah, the visual. I, I knew it had to be extreme. I knew it had to be crazy. I knew how to, it had to be out there. And I knew it, whether people liked it or not, needed to make people go, what? You know what I mean? Did you write the treatment? Oh, I wrote the whole video. Yeah. 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 I came up with the video. You were like directing it. End of 2022. Scenes. And so then. Whoa. 2022, baby. Yeah. That's two yeah. years ago. Mm -hmm. So I came up with it then. And we filmed it at the end of 2023. But yeah, I, I, I Is produced there anything it. you can tease that's not a tease? That's anything? not out. Anything is that there I can a storyline? I mean, yeah. Is there? You know, I what the storyline started as and what it ended as. I'll say this: it is so complicated. No one really understood how it was going to make sense, and so I'm explaining the story to the director and the choreographer and my mom, and everyone's like. Hi, Dad. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> GT coming in hot. What up, GT baby? GT coming in whenever they want. Sit down and enjoy Carol's the show. Right <laughs> How Hi. are you? Swinging, you? Swinging. I am swinging, too. Oh, yeah. In the music business. She's in the music We're business. We're yeah. The cameras are rolling. Let's keep this interview going, okay. shall we? <laughs> you... What were you doing? God damn it. Was, I was talking about the story of the, the video. Story yes. of the storyline of the video. Yes, you were yeah. to your mom. And how they didn't get it when you yeah, told them. Yeah, no one officially got it. And then once it was all edited together, everyone was like, oh, this makes perfect sense. And I was like, I told you it would. But basically, wow. it's that the, the overall concept is that your karma, no matter what, is going to catch you in the end. Yes. And so sometimes it is better to just, to just face it, right? Originally, the video was supposed to end with me all alone because if you fuck up and you're not good, not a good person, that's how you're gonna end up. You know what I mean? And that's what the song is about: saying karma's a bitch and she's with you right now, and it's saying that I am her. You know what I mean? And so, anyways, the video though, we're in rehearsals, and I got this idea. I was like, wait, what if this was all like a flash forward? Like I'm about to make a wrong choice, and I see what's gonna happen. Then we go back in time to where I'm making that choice. That's a raven. We see that. And what choice do I make? Sick. Uh, Video game. Love and it. I was like, what choice is it? And there was three options. There was one, we make neither. We cut, and that gives us a follow-up. We can, we can come back to it. Part two. There's a part <laughs> two. There was another option of, I'm going to make the right choice. And there was a third option of, 
nah, I'm a bad girl. I'm going to make the wrong choice. I'm a bad girl. And so the whole video is like, you see the bad thing that's going to happen to me if I make this wrong choice. And at the end of the video, I'm like, Wrong choice. Still want it. Still you want did? the wrong choice. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love that. Sick. And it's 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 a it's I I actually I today I texted my whole label and I was like everybody it's seven fifty seven I'm posting this right now I'm trying to caption it and I can't call it a music video I was like I can't I Bro, can't I not that. Do I it. noticed it was visualizer music music visual I was love like it. I cannot call visual. it a music video because it is it a is. Movie. It, I mean, it, like, we've been joking around that it's major motion picture in two and a half minutes. Like, it is psychotic. And also, I have to tell you before I leave, because we're planning video number two right now. Oh, my God. Number two, whether people like it or not, it's going to be their guilty pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a song that we wrote before my son was existing. <laughs> That's how you know how long ago it was. It was, I'll never forget, leaving the session, writing this song. Yeah. To go pick up Riley's glasses for the first time. Because I right. said, oh. I said, should I go? Or should I stay here and write this song? Yes. And you said, your kid's only going to get his first pair of glasses once. Once. Go. And you made me go. And then yeah. when we left, didn't you guys like flip everything upside it, down? No, I wrote it in the in the verse, uh, I, or the pre-chorus. I sang it to their group chat. And I was like, what about this? And it's literally the pre-chorus. As you're, you're like hear. on the way to, to go. The we <laughs> yeah. were pulling into the parking lot. And I was like, I crushed it. Here we go. <laughs> One of my favorite things about the songs that we've wrote together is the stories behind them of how they've come to be, right? And the way that the world is going to think they know what guilty pleasure is about. Like they are, but what it's actually about and how it actually started. God, I can't even remember this these days, dude. I mean, <laughs> I can fully remember. What was it? You you literally came into the session. You're like, I've got an idea, everyone. Oh, yeah. And you're like, dads come up to me. And they say, all about that face is my guilty That's pleasure. Right. Yeah. And you were like, I think we should do it. And then at I the time. I was like, is this about when dads come up to me? And they're like, dude, I don't even like you, but I love your songs. So it's I'm like, my guilty <laughs> pleasure. Huh? That's yep. why we wrote it. Thank That's you. right, yep. dude. Yep. And I was like, That's going to be your amazing pop it. music. And yeah. like, yeah. waste of a heartbreak. Oh, yeah. oh, you're just leaking everything. Right that came now. out so fast. That came out so fast. No, I mean, I love it. Leak. She's that one. Leak. That one's gonna take some time, anyways, to come out. So sick. it's it's okay to talk. I about. love this song personally. A it's got that dirty beat. My title was your title. It is my favorite. It is like literally number one, but structurally on our timeline of what I want to come out when. Yeah, it's far out. Just yeah. because honestly, we didn't know what move number two was going to be. We were like, let's start Karma World. Let's kind of see. And the second that I knew that that one was going to be our number two, I was like, let's go. I'm going to tell you the video idea before I already? leave Already? You already have it? You're going to shit. What is going on? <laughs> uh, visual um, idea. Visual idea. Let me not. Let me not. Yeah, okay. It's not a music video. No, no, no. Music visual. We, music visual. I'm so excited. I love this. We have to finish the song. Song's not done yet. Yeah, yeah. Today, song's not done. No. <laughs> as long as we could have it by April 7th. I'm shooting the video on April 8th, so that would be Bitch. ideal. Okay, no yeah. one's on the same team because Paul. your label told us like, nah, we got time. And I was like, well, JoJo's um, recording the video now. So yeah. what do you mean we have time? <laughs> okay, good to know. Yeah. Okay. April 6th and 7th is rehearsals. So I don't believe me. Okay. We're producing it today. It's going to be done. Tonight. Love it. Love it. Um, Yeah. This, your second single, Bibbidi Bot, we was a part of it. Guilty Pleasure. Shout out to all the dads and the bros, the older bros that are like, I don't even like Megan Trainor. Yep. To my face. They're like, but your shit is good. But and you're I'm my like, guilty pleasure. Yep. Uh-huh. Yep. Um, so yeah, I hope everyone listens to that song. Listen to Karma. Watch the music video. It's so good. It's Wait, not a music also, video. It's a music visualizer. Visualizer movie. It's all, it's all the same. Also, I meant to say before, since like you never get a word in, is when when you were talking about like growing up in the in, yeah. in the fame world. Going yeah. from young. You did that, but yeah. there was no Instagram. Right. So that was a different world. Yeah. And there were no comments. Right. Yeah. There were no comments. But that's I, that's what I love about you. I, I think it's so inspiring how you handle all of it. Yeah. You that's know? what you, I like. You are, you're my favorite because like I see so many people crumble with, you know, Negative attention me. and things like that. Not just you. My other I'll get one well. they go down. <laughs> me too. Yeah. I'll but get like, one bad comment and I'm like, I'm out for a week by like yeah. crying. It's brutal. But I just love that your glass half full. Like it hurts. But yeah. at the end of it, you go, but I have so much going for me. And like your and, numbers and your, are crazy. Yeah, it's pushing the, the algorithm. The numbers, yeah. The algorithm numbers likes are wild. the comments. Yeah. The algorithm loves the comments. The numbers are wild. 
And whether you like it or not, it is. It's Come it's, as a bitch. And it's a guilty pleasure. <laughs> yeah, and that is why pleasure. it's our number two. Because it is, whether people like it or not, they chose what my number two moment was going to be. That's big. They chose it. They I didn't did know. This. I had four that I was like, one, two, three, or four could come next. Wow. Let's be on standby. Let's watch what move, what how karma goes. Because if people were like, "Why is she still singing so poppy?" Then I'm gonna give you something that's even poppy. Also, though, oh, 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 oh. fuck you, yeah. oh. <laughs> shove it down their throats. Yeah. Also, like you're a pop star. Thank you. You've been singing like that, like not, like the outfits and the fa- like. What's making the no? only thing that is you've been painting your skull for years. For years, <laughs> the only thing that like genuinely, I wish I could go through the phone. And like have a sit down conversation with somebody and be like, let me explain why, Susie. (laughs) (laughs) It's when someone's like, you're you're still a kid. You rhinestone your ears. Fuck (laughs) me. Like rhinestoning my ears does not make me a kid. That makes me like, like for wearing a pink and black and yellow necklace today. That makes you a kid. Like that's That's what they say. And right nah. now, if they're ghosts, and so I'm, and the, you need to life. ditch the crazy costumes. Like, have you ever met That's an Elton like, John? Yeah, yeah, I know. I was like, but <laughs> if we know JoJo, we know that this is who she is, and, and she I'm not, loves that part. your whole concerts, everything. And I'm not here to give you a different human. Yeah, I'm here to give you an adult JoJo. I, I was, I looked at their comments and was like, what did you think was gonna happen? Like, what do you want? To what think you- I was just gonna like. Start twerking in a thong? Like, I didn't, I was like, what was... What Maybe was if it, it was, like, rhinestoned and t- tool on it and out but there. Was like, like, rhinestones. Like, like, I had JoJo, um, because I was so pregnant with Riley, I had JoJo help me and, and be the star of my music video. That was for, the best I believe day of Santa. my life. That was the best day of my life. Do you know I run that dance, like, literally twice a week? <laughs> Every day. Santa, check it out. But she shows up and was like, I've been up since four. I did this all myself. And we're like, what? <laughs> and she, you had the biggest, coolest, craziest outfit and like a full bejeweled I head did, and face. I did. And I was like, oh, you didn't have to go all out for me. But I was like, that's who JoJo that's is. Do. Yeah. Yep. Your mom was, yeah. what was that? Zip ties. Zip tying yep. your pony. And I was like, yep. Jesus Christ. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, sir. And you're like, Everybody yeah. petitioned for Megan to do a live performance of I Believe, I believe in, Santa, in Santa so I can I'm just going to have you yes, dance. You yes. I'm going to be on the <gasps> side, side stepping. Can you do it on your Santa. tour? What I days are you touring? What what days? Well, September and October, until, and then we're probably going to do like a Christmas special. Yeah, you're going to promote. We'll come back. She promotes Christmas it's every year. there's a Christmas special. Yeah. You'll be in it, I promise. And you don't <laughs> sing I How Believe in Santa. It wouldn't make sense. I will dance. I need you. I need you. I will dance. Yeah, I'm not going to do it. I've been asking for this for five years. I know. Everyone's been asking can, can I ask about the karma dance? How did you make that dance? No, Who, I know uh, how. What happens? Oh, how do you know how? Let's because hear it. Richie. Richie. Okay, so Richie's brilliant. What people don't know too is like the foot, the choreographer that JoJo's been working with since you were like a baby. Nine is one of the most legendary choreographers. Absolutely, I can't say choreographer. Choreographer is tough. One. Um. She, because he worked with Lady Gaga and all yes. her big dance moves. Oh, and yes. if you watch, like went on tour with her, did these yes. steps with her, and if you watch her dance moves, they're crazy. <laughs> but that's why it was so cool. It that's was why people always loved it. about getting people to Attention, talk. yeah. And we literally, he has been asking to do the grab the ass, shake it. For, for years. six years with I me. I was like, there's an uh, there's an upgrade. I've never seen he, you he wa- he, jiggle it. <laughs> we have had to grab the ass and shake and you it you were up. like, no. We've had it for six years in our pocket. He's like, this is the move, troops. What do you know? That's the move that troops. people picked up on. Then this step. <laughs> this yeah. is it. I love it. I love it. We spent an hour in rehearsal <laughs> trying, <laughs> to so trying to find it. Trying to find it. And and it was Richie. Okay, JoJo Nation, let's try some here, troops. <laughs> and and he does it, and I'm like, it feels weird. And I told him, I was Did like, Richie, him? I was like, this step doesn't like because none of the dancers were finding it. And I have the fucking really? top dog dancers standing yeah. behind me, and like they can't find it, I can't find it. And I was like, we all need the counts because Richie's like, your timing's off. And I was like, give us the counts. Like, what is the counts? And he goes. It's not the counts, it's a feeling troops. And I was oh like, my fuck. I was like, okay, for us to find it though, we need the counts. And so I was yeah. like, I'm gonna play the song, you do it, and then I'm gonna count it and tell the dancers. So we do it, and I he I tell the dancers, I was like, okay, you drop on the and you're up on the uh like dancer language. Yeah. And Richie was like, no, Jojo Nation, it's just the feeling. And I was like, 
dancers it's just a feeling on the uh and on the yeah on the <laughs> what do you know he plays the music and we go in and all of us were like what like it just like is it the best dance move absolutely not there is no such thing as the best dance move but how am i sitting here with the three of you and i'm doing that we're and you know what i'm talking about yeah. you That's know what Richie. okay do you remember my performance the only time i got to work with oh, him oh i know this story they like i fucking love they, this story i didn't have my choreographer at the time and they brought Richie in and I was like, who is this? And then I'm I'm singing Like I'm Gonna Lose You at the AMA's opening before I do Marvin Gaye with Charlie and then we made out and yeah, everyone yeah, talked yeah, about yeah, forever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in my Most Like I'm Gonna Lose You, I was like, I don't need a choreographer, it's a ballad. And he's like, oh honey, we about to get you dancing on a ballad. And yeah. I was like, what? And if you, can you make watch a visual. it, if you watch it, I'm doing full fucking choreo to yep. found myself dream. That was to like I'm gonna lose you. Do you remember that? And I was like, Because I went through the I clips, dancing? I was like, what the fuck is she moving so much? Why I thought it was I no. Not? I thought it was Richie no. Because Richie said you can dance on a ballad. Richie said, and I was like, Troops, we can dance on a ballad. She's Troops. Like, Girl, we need to get to the Megan trainer that I've been waiting for. And I was That's like, awesome. Sir, it looks sick. It's a ballad. Yeah. <laughs> it looks sick. I feel like a star. No, the and thing it was the best day ever. He knows so well how to get people talking. He's just like the riskiest risk He's, taker. Yeah. He, I love it. He actually is the one who came up for music visual number two for Ooh. our little duo. Well, of course. Nice. Yeah, he. Gave, I had an idea that I was stoked about. Got the whole team. He pitched his first, and I was like, "Fuck all with my idea." Oh, I was like, wow, "I ain't even pitching." Really? For guilty pleasure? Mm-hmm. Oh my yep. god, I'm so excited. Yep. <laughs> but what do you do about your your neck? Because the neck. Oh, that looks, oh my god! Like, Before I came it? here, I literally I was like, "I'm gonna." I have the outfit on. I was like, "I'm gonna do a dance video. I'm gonna do it in my driveway." When I tell you, I was like, <laughs> crack, 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 crack. Oh, your body. I was like. Ow. Um, day day one of rehearsals, we came in for day two and we were all like huh. You really do twelve hours? Oh yeah, at least. Bro, I'll but, give them like three and I'll be like, no. I'm done. So the but dancers will have I like a up. nine hour day and then I'll go for like two or three before them and like two or three after them. And so I just yeah, I'm there all day. But then on my own days, like if I have a day off, I'll be at the studio all day long. Have my own. Well, yeah. I work so hard. I try. Uh, I hate it when people are like, You're such a try hard. I'm like, Yes, I am. Yeah, what's I try really what's hard, actually. Yeah. Thank you. Bingo. Kids these days yeah. just don't want no, to. They're just, too cool. Everyone's it's too like, cool to and try. The, and try. The Instagram, Not they're more. nicer. And YouTube, they're nicer. TikTok yes. can be violent. It used to be different. TikTok it in the used beginning to be was TikTok very, was nice. You were like, TikTok's, I was like, TikTok's the TikTok's nicest place in the world. Place. And then yeah, a huh? fucking rain of fire just <laughs> came from nowhere. It is. You, I messaged you and you were like, to be honest, yeah, this is a lot different than I thought it would be. But like... You know, my numbers are great. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, no, it works. I think I just expected a little more of a balance. Yeah. Like, and now it is doing the flip. I knew at some point it was going to flip because I knew if I was just going to keep doing it, that eventually people are going to have to be like, okay, wait, maybe. You know what I mean? And we so that need, flip is happening. Like, well, that's the thing. You don't give them the power. That part. You right. hold on to your power. And I love that. That part. Yeah, when someone really bugs me, my therapist goes, "Wow, you give them so much power." Mm -hmm. I'm like, mm -hmm. and there's, <laughs> it's it's, but it's hard. It's so hard, literally, and it's also hard in person. If you guys were sitting here right now, sorry, I'm about to make you the bad guy. Yeah, you looked at me and you were like, "Your hair looks great." You looked at me and you were like, "Yeah, your hair looks really great." And you look at me and you're like, "I've seen it better." I'm not. Yeah. Screw what you two just yeah, said. That's I'm, it. Yeah. Oh my god, my hair looks. Oh, bad. Sh you know what I mean, like. And so that's the same way. It's like, no matter how many nice you get, if that And won. nobody would say these things in your face. At all. Also, if At you all. ever, like, I've, like, clicked on the profile of mean comments on my thing, and they're, no one. Like, yep. It's like, they have no posts, and yep. they're just there to bully. And I'm like, well, yep, get away. And this, <laughs> the, like, number scheme of things, too, is is hard to realize, but really beautiful when you can, like, 4,000 comments is a lot of comments. That's a lot. I don't get that I would that be much. stoked to have 4,000 comments, right? Love 4,000 nice comments, right? I'm like, oh my God, that's <laughs> fucking everybody. Yeah. Like everybody loves <laughs> Everyone it. Everyone loves me. <laughs> but then what I do is if it's 4,000 mean comments, I'm like, in the scheme of things, that's nothing. <laughs> mm -hmm. 4,000 people, world, like in like, the scheme what? of seven, okay. 7 million, that's like zero point 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 point. Zero 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 zero. Like nobody. Three. Like that's and, literally nothing. Andrew Santino told us when I was like, "How do you deal with like you get death threats, sir? Like how do you deal with this?" And he was like, "They're ghosts. They're not real. That part. They're not real people. They're ghosts." And I, I like, don't understand oh. how people are that mean. 
Like, I know. Bro, I've never commented anything on anyone. Could like, you or imagine? Like, Get it. I did know? that one. I don't know if you saw it where I, I genuinely was like, oh, I'm going to film a video outside while I'm getting gas to karma like me doodaloo. And the caption was going to be my brain 24-7 for the last three years, like with that song in my head, right? Just like me getting gas looking around. All of a sudden, the gas starts spraying out of the nozzle as it's in my car. And I didn't notice for a second. And then there's gas everywhere. It Ooh. was like, I pulled it out and it was... Like, it was yeah. actually kind of hysterical. Not hysterical, but like, wait, what? Like, I didn't know what to do, but I caught it on video. And so I was like, oh my God, this is hysterical. I gotta post it. Post it. You should light a cigarette right there and see what happens. No. Like, like there's a funny comment, like, but that, like, people Silly saying right bum. now, I was a bagel instead of I was a bad girl. Like, that's funny. Live your life. Do your thing. Mm. Saying I should light a cigarette yeah, no. for the first time and just see what happens. No. That's awful. That's a death threat. That is awful. Like, how? Karma's a bitch. Karma's that part. a bitch. That part. Um, That's no. insane. Uh, our, I have another friend who's like popping on TikTok. Um, and it's like, yeah, they're, 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 they're dealing with it. It's they're, 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 they're dealing, they're dealing with, with it. Yeah. Yeah. I have a lot of friends on TikTok. You don't know. Who I was going to say, that could about. be so many people. I, bitch. Well, yep. bitch. <laughs> but it's hard. She's dealing with it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they're dealing with it. And it's getting to them, though. <laughs> Where, like, you can tell, and you're like, mm, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It sucks. Because there's, a, a, there's yeah. a flip that gets switched. You get very, very famous, and then the hate rolls. I, I, like, yeah. You know what we're going to do? We're going to tell them to listen to this fucking episode. Yeah. yeah. No, That's I right. tell, Seriously. If I see you someone work I know. On it. If I <laughs> see need- someone I know, you're different, because I'm like, she can handle this wave. But if I see someone I know that's going through it, I text them, like, it only means you're getting more successful. Congratulations. No, <laughs> like, but it is true. It when is I true. get more successful, like more storm comes. Yep. And I'm like, it means I'm doing something also, good. I don't know if this is just me and I'm a little messed up, but anything that anyone says to me, I've already said it to myself. Oh, Same. Tough. Ugh. I know. Like, I, that's worse, why, that's worse why I'm like sad at yeah. comments because I'm like, that's what I thought. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, the worst is when someone's like, that too. "She looks like she gained weight," and I'm like, "Shit, it's noticeable." <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> that's my favorite comment. You're crazy. <laughs> maybe it's like the like, universe, like, oh, maybe you, it's like, not just my menstrual cycle. No. Maybe it's really <laughs> happening. <laughs> you always fit. You wear weighted vests. I have had to learn <laughs> that I am not little. I am strong, strong, and I, I'm meaty. Like I, <laughs> I ain't ashamed of it anymore. But like I. I went through a phase like post dancing with the stars where I was little. I would, I mean, I, I'm like normally like a size six. I'm a, I'm a, I'm, that's my size, right? Not big, not small. Like just living my life. Dancing with the stars post, I was a zero or a two. I was what? Like just like bones, tiny, tiny. Wow. And then after it, I mean, I went on tour, so staying that size, came back, and I mean, of course, I'm gonna gain weight. Like I'm not, you know what I mean? And but now I look back at that and I'm back in my six, back in my sometimes eights and like living my life, feeling fine. But I'm like, shit, how did I look like that? And then I'm like, but think about how weak you were. Like now I can partner with girls and I can chuck them over my head with one hand. I can partner with girls and chuck them. <laughs> like you'll you see need that strength. You'll see when you see karma, like I could not do the steps that I'm doing with the girl in it. Oh, sick. If I was that size. And so yeah. I've, I've had to learn my strength versus my, like, appearance. Okay, tomorrow in the music video, we're going to see you swing a girl up in the air. Yes. <gasps> wow. You're going to see does me her own stunts. quite literally launch her with my wussy ossy and she flips. It's, I mean, it's- in, What? In water. In what? water. This is going to be the craziest video ever, dude. We got. I can't wait to watch. Oh, I'm so excited. What about boxing? You ever get into boxing? I love boxing. Yeah, dude. Love it. We got I to see fight. in the ring. Like, have you ever seen my special forces fight? Fuck, we, we blew need it off. We, we, really we need to binge it. all of them now. Okay, let's go. Let's go. On special forces, I got to fight an Olympic athlete. Her name is Erin Jackson. She is ripped. Only thing that I have over her is I'm a little taller. Reach. Very, very Reach. slight difference. <laughs> but I mean, it's day five or six of special forces. We are all done, exhausted. Here you go. And it's, Fine. they say, they say, this isn't strictly calm. I don't want to see you dancing. Like the show in the UK. It's Dancing with the Stars, but in the UK. Don't want to see you dancing. I don't want to see you cuddling. I don't want to see boxing. I want you to fucking kill each other. And so they say, fight. And you just like, 
What? And so we start, and I mean, like, it's me and Aaron. Like, we're friends at this point, so we're, like, tip-tapping each other. And they know that, the DS. And so they're like, headshots, fucking kill each other. You're not going in. So finally, like, we start going, like, a little harder. And then Aaron knocked me first. She went, whoop, bam, got my face, got my head. Ooh. And, I mean, the, it's the best when the boys, <gasps> Tyler tells this story the best. But I, like, came up and, like, red and there was no coming back for her it was like something switched to me after she hit me that like i won the fight by a landslide oh it my was god like, she hit me and i i mean she we gotta watch this, gotta see this fuck yeah yeah i'll show you the video <laughs> of it it's gnarly i remember when we were writing these songs two years ago you were like talking about doing some famous uh wrestling thing or something wwe yeah you're like i, I was I sign up for this and i was like i see that for yeah you. i was i actually i was i was like in i was already started kind of doing stuff with them on good faith and then when it came to deal terms it was not it not was good faith. Faith. <laughs> yeah it was not it was not good faith <laughs> um but i was but i i did enjoy my time that i did with them like i got to meet some great people i have friends that do it like it was it was cool, and what they were gonna do with me was cool. But honestly, it was the exclusivity thing. I just couldn't give. I couldn't give that. Yeah, gotcha. How old well, are you? Me. Yeah. Twenty. Twenty. You're twenty. I'm twenty. Man, so I... back off, everyone. It's Isn't my that crazy? Twenty-year-old little baby. I like. I think about it all the time. I just started to realize this. I look at my friends because I most most of my friends, my like golden friends, are thirty and I'm older. I'm thirty. That's, like, my, like, people who I, like, really know I can trust are that age. You know what I mean? But then I have, like, some, like, fun friends that are dancers and they're just, like, this is just my like fun vibe. And they are 20, 23, 22, like, 24. They're all in this age range, right? And I look at them and I'm, like, they're stressing about things in their life or they're stressing about their relationships or their problems or their career. And I'm, like, you're such a baby. I was, like, you're 23. Yeah. And then I was, like, I'm tw I'm three years younger than you. Yeah. Like, wow. I, it's just gotten put into perspective how young I am for me because I feel like from the time I was 14 to 20, I was 30. You know what I mean? I was yeah. working as a 30-year-old. And so yeah. now that I'm 20, I'm like, wait, I'm supposed to be 20? It's sick, dude. I feel like you've time traveled and you're only beginning. That part. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? It's so crazy. You're only beginning. Look, all, look at all you've accomplished already. It's crazy. Thank you. You like pretty much want to dance with the stars. You know what I mean? Like you've done so much. <laughs> I like that. You my, like, my heart. <laughs> my my not win is the accomplishment. That not the sick. fucking book thing at best time <laughs> seller. Not the TED yeah, talk. Yeah, yeah. Not the record at the O2 Arena. Like not any of my that cool credits. It was the first thing that just youngest person to do special forces. Youngest person to do mass singer. Okay, now first so now, same sex couple wait, of dancing with the stars. Wait, that I got I fucking second. I know. <laughs> and then. I want I want to know because people ask me this and I said it and then I got it. Where do you want to be in five or ten years? I want to live in this house. Okay. <laughs> okay. With Freddie, Eddie, you and Teddy, my it. children. Freddie, Eddie, and Teddy. I love these names. Yeah. Freddie, Eddie, and Teddy. I do want babies very bad. I feel like you know that. I know that. You know that yeah. about me. You're yeah. my only friend that understands that with me because yeah. I've wanted them since I was your age. Yeah. I'm like people. I was 26. Go ahead at 26. Yeah. Go ahead. I think like 24. I mean, our like mom was what? 23? Our mom was 24. 24. Yeah. She says 24, but I think she was 23. I think I think when I'm 23, I would give my egg into another person's belly with one of my good friends' sperm and let it bake. And then it would be she or okay. he would be born when I'm around 24. You know what I mean? So I feel like that, that world. Um, no, I, I really, that is like my number one priority. I even cook for myself now as if I was also cooking for my children. Like I, I, I love it. I want babies so bad. Um. They are the greatest. You will love them. Yeah. So wait. wait. So what does that mean? You cook yourself a meal and then you make it like a little kitty's meal? <laughs> like, like, here, Freddie, Teddy, Teddy. <laughs> yeah, wait, wait, wait. wait. No, she's she just like, you know, like a little dino it's nugget. Like in like, her yeah. mind, as she's making her meal, like, oh, I'm going to be making Like, how would I Freddy. modify this? Like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. if I'm washing grapes, I'll be like, oh, man, I can't wait to cut like these in the forest. That's like when we were dating, like, <laughs> I was 22, right? 23? Mm-hmm. And we would walk by diapers and the baby aisle and I would cry. Yep. I was like, I, it just doesn't make sense that I'm not picking these up. Just yet. Like, I just like, want to now. Why am I not ordering? The, why am I not putting these things in my cart? Yep. And I asked my therapist, like, something's wrong, dude. I'm broken. And then she was like, no, you're already mothering your babies. Like, yep. you're just excited. You're just excited. And you're already there. Yep. And I was like. I'm like, ah. <laughs> I started yeah. crying. Yeah, no, li literally. I can't wait for that. You're um, already mothering them. I also, I mean, I love performing. It is my favorite thing to do. And I definitely want to be touring. 
um, like put me on the road for years. Like I'm about to tour with my babies. I'll let you know how that goes. Please. <laughs> because Please. I've asked Gwen Stefani. I'm trying to like DM Pink. Um, I don't think she looks at her DMs, but I'm like, help. You know, like yeah. I'm trying to say, because I know it can they're be done. queens and they've done it, you know? People that I could connect you with that could help. Very different worlds, but all of the Dancing with the Stars pros. They just got oh. off to her. Jenna, my and partner, they bring their brought her baby. <gasps> yeah, Danny and Pasha please, just got their babies. Please connect me. In a I text. should connect you with Jenna. Because I, really I got like different ages. Like Riley's a little easier; he's three years old. But this Barry, this yeah. he's going to be one. And Rome he's is Barry's be, age. He's going to be like walking barely and like crawling out of his crib. Like, oh well, yeah. Like, he's an nail animal. A crib that one to the ground and like lock him they, in. There. They like, had like they like. You know how like a, the the room in the bu- in the bus has like that like nook kind of in between the like bed and like the like back wall like a pretend closet. Yeah, they like shoved the pack and plate. I've also heard that from another person. Yeah, you kind of just like rig it. Yeah, yeah. No, I should definitely give you Jen's number because Rome is Barry's age when Barry, when you'll be on oh, tour. Okay. He's just a little bit older. Rome is such older. a sick name. So what? cute. <laughs> so so cute. I can get an old. But man you also name. you have help. Like, yeah, I got, I got like, my mom's coming, Ryan's coming, we're bringing a nanny to help us. Yeah, like you have- I just don't know how to like help them sleep on the bus. That's what I'm scared of. They'll be fine. And here's the thing. What are they not gonna, yeah, what are they, are they- Every bump wakes them up. Yeah, like I think, no. I honestly it might help because it is rocky. I know, baby, like, that's, that's what I'm sleep. banking on. I can yeah. see him just yeah, be, no. he's gonna wake up and just be so excited. We're on a bus, we're on yeah, a bus, yeah, yeah. we're on a Riley's bus. Gonna he's just like, gonna be up. We're going to bus? Yeah. <laughs> Riley's so cute. You pulled your so are so cute. Mm. You guys did so good. Thanks. Thanks. We did your, your nephews are cute. <laughs> they Thanks. are. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. And if you it's a big um, accomplishment for me. <laughs> if you know any straight girls that want boyfriends. She's 20 years old, dude. Well, actually, you uh, said you're you were right. friends with 30 year olds. You're friends with 30 year olds. If oh, you know any wait. straight girls, she knows she has a lot of friends. Ryan. I have a lot of straight girlfriends. All right, we'll have we'll talk. Are you on maybe. the market? I am. He is I am. ready to I've been going to, uh, I was going to say, if you want to join me at work, I put the surfboard down and now I'm a Pilates babe. Let's if you want to go to Pilates. I'm yo. And I, you would I, I have with you, dude. two weeks to get snatched right now for Pilates. the pleasure visual. So let's go. The pleasure visual? It's fucked. I did it this morning. Welcome to Joe's no, Pleasure all, House. My friends have been going Ooh. to this class with him. <laughs> Who is the teacher? Shout her out. Oh, Sarah. Sarah and the... the Sarah, you psycho. The uh, company is Rise is Up. Rise Up. Let's I've go. Heard that. I'm so down. She'll yeah. be like, and this is your last set in three, two, and ten more. Yeah, and yeah, ten. Yeah. And I'm like, <gasps> bullying. But you can do <laughs> now it. Now pulse. I go... <laughs> I got to bond with Let's this girl today. Luckily, she suffered with me. We just look at each other like, Fucking done. Honestly, as a straight man, Pilates is the place to go. That's <laughs> like, oh, it's, it's a so dream. Funny. I go, I can't we, believe no one's figured this out. No, I mean, we're just we would travel, like we went to Australia, and I was like, let's go to Pilates, dude. I bet there's hot girls. And we went, and it was like the one class that had all elderly women. And we were just like, it's a different what crowd. the fuck is it's going on? And I was like, sorry, bro. No, this is like the valley. There's, it's it's serious. These girls don't fuck around, too. Like, I'm in there making jokes. I'm like, this is so hard. And everyone's just like, serious. Like, and then, yeah, no. mouth. And, uh, and then no. I'm like, yeah, ladies. And everyone's like, shut the fuck up. They're just miserable. Like, They're like, invited him. <laughs> you invited him. Yeah. They're serious. They I don't know, play. Yeah. They I will go every anytime day. you want. Anytime. Right, okay. yeah, I'll, I'll do yeah. the next time I go. Let's I need it. like a day off from each time you. I do it. But <laughs> when we went serving together, I was like, so you ready to go tomorrow? He was like, I need three days to recover. I'll see <laughs> yeah, I'm 31 oh, yeah. years old. Like, I'm exhausted, dude. And I was like, Oh, that's what okay. you will notice with age. You are still yeah. young and you have time without the kids right now. It's already changed. Like, I, I can. Re- I'm sore. That's what I was no. about your neck. Yeah, you like, like a chiropractor dude, or something. The one yeah. time My I- dad's a chiropractor. There you go. Oh, yeah. that's nice. Yeah, it's great. Too bad he lives in Florida. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't. No. Make it big. I just friends. thought oh that. Oh, my Florida. God. <laughs> um, no, one time I was with <laughs> JLo, she, I was asking her, like, how do you dance like all, like, at, like, how do you do all these moves and do tour and blah, 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 nonstop? And she was like, you know, for the first time ever, I'm finally sore. Like, she was like, I never got sore when I was younger. And I was like, what? Yeah. It's like, why am I sore just from walking? I feel like now we just got to like maintain it. Yeah. 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 Crazy. It all just changes as you get older. And your soreness. 20. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. But your soreness. It doesn't shrink yet. I can't. (laughs) Get stuff out here. (laughs) <laughs> also, don't drink. It's a scam. I so, hate it. I hate yeah, it. So I've tried it. I hate it. Like, I we're trying it. to play my 21st right now. 
Might as well go to Disney. Yeah, Disney. My mom's like, what are we going to do? So actually, we're going to have my 21st as of now. The plan has changed a lot, but this is my plan that I'm like, I'm actually down for this. 21st birthday, everything but alcohol is the theme. Oh, we have a Ryan, smoothie bar. Go. We have a juice bar. <laughs> We have a, a, a slushy station. We oh, have yeah, I'm going. a soda <laughs> station, a flavored water station, a lemonade uh, station. Everything but alcohol. I love that. Well, I don't like alcohol. We did sucks, we did Shirley dude. Temples at Megan's 30th. We did, True. Yeah. That Shirley was nice. Temples. Honestly, <laughs> let's do it. Shirley Temples and Diet <laughs> the Coke. Best. Yeah. yeah. Sober Rovers. We're sober. Um, okay. Yeah. Did we get everything I down? Think, I think we crushed. I think I it was a very I, good episode. I agree. I asked you to do this like two days ago and you're a champ. Yeah, you came in close. I can't believe you did it's like, so Let's awesome. play. I'm down. Let's I love play. You. I love you so much. Anytime. Um, Thank you're you my hero. I think us pop stars. Dad. Dad. <laughs> I think us pop stars should do sleepovers and figure out how to live this life. How to be mentally happy. Yeah. <laughs> Because I'm not okay. Yeah. You guys no. get together and go, let's turn our comments off. Three, two, two one. one. No, it would be this. It would be like, how are you? Oh my God, I'm so good. How are you? Oh, I'm so great. An hour later, we are sobbing. sobbing. I'm actually not okay. I'm not okay. That's how my days go. I'm yep. like, everything's right. great. And then I'm like, why is the post blurry? <laughs> you should come out to Studio C well one day. That's where we all have therapy. Because none of us will go to therapy, meaning me. No, you won't go. I won't go. I love oh. it. I won't go. I'm, I, why? I... Oh, Honestly, you're 20. Okay. I'm I'm young, yeah. But when I was 14, someone very close to me said, "Don't go, don't spill your guts to a stranger," because they were close to somebody that had spilled their guts to a stranger, and then their stranger spilled their guts for the world. Okay, well that's illegal. Well, yeah, that's illegal. Yeah. It's illegal. So you could sue. But it's and I promise I won't ever happen to you. I'm just like, I feel like I'm really good at shoving it down and focusing on the positive. That's going to explode. Yeah. Yeah. Just yeah. what happened. Yeah. You're yeah. talking yeah. to the You're queens young. of that. <laughs> yeah. Coming from comes someone out that exploded. In, <laughs> comes out in alcoholism like, and drug yes. addicts. No, that'll not, that, 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 that will never happen. happen. I know, it's but like, something It's like else. when you eat food, it's got to come out somehow. It's that. You keep <laughs> can your we make it? Can in, we make a deal? It's going to come out. I'm ready. Before you become a parent, go to therapy. Oh, well, let's not deal. force therapy not down someone. No, you know, no, no. Just try, try. It. <laughs> it's, no, let's force it. No, 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 no. <laughs> just try it. Just no, try I it. Think, look, just honestly, try like five sessions. My thing no. is like, I at some point in my life, I never worked out, and at some point in my life, I was like, wait, I actually think I might enjoy this. I think this might be a good oh, thing for me to pick love up. Therapy, yeah. and I feel like one day, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a. Oh, therapy's a bad thing. You shouldn't do it. Like yeah. that's never. And I'm with me. I'm not even like I shouldn't do it. I'm like it's just like I don't. You need, it's like dating. Yeah, exactly. And it's yeah, hard. Yeah. I just convinced my mom after 50 years of never ever doing therapy to start it yep. now. Yeah, yep. to, to and compare. And it took it, yep. it took like years. Yeah, yep. I've had three different yes. therapists, and I'm finally on the right therapist. Yeah, so that's another thing. Is well, like my mom say, is like a new person. Yeah, and is like learning so much, and I'm like, yeah. To compare it to working out for your body, it's just working out for working your out brain. your brain. Exactly. And now, some I, days, oh my like, god, I, I don't want to yeah. go. I went to a trauma after, therapist. Like, okay. I went to a trauma therapist like five times, and that then, part. then I took like um, a lot of time off from that, and like wasn't in the A program. Like now I'm in AA, so like now that's, that's like kind of like therapy. my therapy because I'm dealing yeah. with just like brain teal brains. Yeah. So I guess we should do group therapy for pop stars. Yeah. Let's do it. As long as you do the pop star thing, we all just meet up. As long as you guys, we got you. Yeah. <laughs> Ryan's like, as long as I'm invited, like I'll we'll go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. As long as I can be one of the pop stars, I just... yeah. <laughs> you have the slushies. Too. Like, uh, I got you. We got you. Yeah, no, he's I, coming on tour and he's gonna open and DJ. I have to learn how to DJ. My friend's coming over today. We're gonna learn. Yeah, but we're going. He know how. <laughs> it's in September. I have time. How hard can it but, be? But dude, we were at Madison Square Garden taking pics, and Ryan's like, they're like, okay, Ryan, your turn. He's like, what? <laughs> like I'm doing fucked. a photo shoot? No, it's gonna be so Isn't awesome. It cute? It's gonna be so awesome. Um, we're playing LA Forum. Please come. I will be there and jump on stage. Only if you perform, I believe in Santa. <laughs> I mean, I could play it, bro. I could play it. And oh, I would, oh yeah. I'm your I, guilty I go, I go up. Oh, yeah, yeah, I could play your song, but I go up because yes. I'll, I'll go up before like. Yeah, like when people are True. changing out, like after Natasha, and it goes to Megan, like I'll right before me, come bro. Out. Like I'm MC. I'm like, are we having a blast? And I'll because pop the on. LA awesome. show, I'm trying to bring Shit. out as many cool people I know. I will be there. Okay, like October nineteenth, right now. You're busy, but October nineteenth. October nineteenth, I'll be there. Literally, I don't have anything. 
really far away, but I don't have it's anything. Really far away. But that is something that I would prioritize unless they were like, hey, Jojo, you're headlining Madison Square Garden that night. Then <laughs> you're like, also busy. I'll be yeah. in New York. But yeah, if they're like, hey, Jojo, so there's sick. a cute little news opportunity. Have you done the forum? Um, no, but yes. But no, but yes. Like, Kids' Choice Awards the yeah, year that I performed I were see, there. I see. But no. But I yes, yeah, 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 but no. Yeah. <laughs> I feel you. Like I did. I know, I've done like the no. jingle balls everywhere, yeah. but I'm like, no, but this is This is yours. Sure. This is yours. Yeah, that was the only thing that I hated about, okay, hated is dramatic, but only thing that I wished with Dream the Tour is my only shows that got canceled because of COVID were my staples at the time in LA no and MSG in New York. No! And then one in Miami um, was the third one that got canceled. Damn. Everything else we were able to reschedule, but because those three were trying one. so many people yeah. to get there, we just like it. Just That's didn't why I've been toured in seven years. It's Once crazy. I was like ready to again, I was like, ooh, I'm not gathering people together right now. <laughs> it is scary. It's tough. Yeah. And now I'm like, do we have metal detectors <laughs> in all these shows? It's so spooky. It's so spooky. It's going to be great. It's, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. So, okay, be October great. 19th, please, please be there. We're going to finish there. your song today. Everyone, watch Karma. It comes out tomorrow. Tomorrow. Okay. Enjoy. She's Good about luck. To flip a chick. Okay. Put a seatbelt on before you Put watch it. It's gonna... Thanks for hanging, JoJo. Yeah. Oh my thank God. You. Thank you thank guys for having me. Freaking Thanks adoring. for being so strong and being my inspiration. Thanks Ten for being years younger mine. than me. You are my hero. Thanks for being my inspiration. You for keep me going. My whole life. No. <laughs> Have I ever told you about my Korean foreign exchange student story? <laughs> With nope. you? Strap back in, guys. <laughs> really quick. Hold on. Strap it. Strap Let's on. Let's hit it. Hit it, hit it. So, that was the last thing I thought you were about to say. <laughs> I cannot believe I've never told you this. There's no way I've not never told you this. You had a what? You've so, not never. <laughs> not Tell never. us now. <laughs> so when we were, I was 10, we hosted a Korean foreign exchange student. His name was Chan Bin. He comes in our school um, in Nebraska. The school that my brother went to was a sister school with one in Korea. So they basically can send kids and they just have to find a family to basically support them and to live with. And so we took in John Ben for a whole school year and it's his first day. Okay. we get, we have a kid from Korea. Like he's my brother's age. So if I was nine, he was 13 and this was seven years ago. Uh, oh God, no, I'm sorry. This was 11 years ago. It's 11 years ago. And he's in the car and like, it's a kid from Korea, right? So we we don't you don't know what to talk could to him he about speak like English very well, but broken. Okay, like he could understand better than he could talk it. And so like for him to get his point across was always hard. And he's scared. He's never met us before. He's never yeah. been to another country I before. Can't imagine thirteen, like crazy new family. Like so. Anyways, we're all in the car together, and my dad's like, "Play us some of your favorite music." Okay, plugs his phone in. We are expecting some K-pop bops. Like, play us music that's popular in your town. Like, what do you... Because you know I'm all about that bass. When I tell you, no. all of us were like, oh, all about that bass. It was like when it was number one here, yeah. right? And we're like, no, 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 play us, play us like some... Yeah, all about that bass. Korean foreign exchange wow. student, 13-year-old never boy. you told me that. I cannot believe I've never told you that. Oh my God, I feel so cool. Yeah, I like that yeah. story. That was great. Yeah, that was that's great. that was great. That's my little <laughs> that's secret. That's the foreign story. exchange student story. Secret story. I love that. Yeah, that's Damn. that's like one of my like earliest like memories of you and your music was him playing that. Wow. It blows my ear. You're, you're worldwide. Mrs. Yep, worldwide. worldwide. <laughs> whoa, whoa. That's crazy that's to me, me, bro. We got that's we got crazy. Mr. Worldwide and you're Mrs. Worldwide. Yeah. <laughs> Nuts. <laughs> Uh, I love you guys. God, thank you for having me. Thank, thank you so thank you much. Being here. Yes, Watch so Karma. Fun. It's out now. Karma out now. Enjoy. And thanks for listening. Watching thanks whatever you do. Mama. With this podcast. See you guys are the best. Bye. Bye.